Seoul is the unofficial plastic surgery capital of the world, with The New Yorker reporting that as many as one in three South Korean women have gone under the knife. The city even has an improvement quarter, where there are reportedly as many as 500 clinics within a square mile. <laughs> the nation's obsession with surgery is largely due to its music scene, where cosmetic enhancements have become the norm. Here's what some K-pop celebs look like before the plastic surgery. Human from Tiara K-pop groups are formed via a large-scale auditioning process similar to shows like American Idol. However, K-pop auditions typically take place behind closed doors. Walk-ins are held every weekend in both South Korea and the United States, according to Seoul Beats, with some of the industry's top companies opening offices in New York to scope out potential talent stateside. This is the process that Human went through to become the lead rapper and lead vocalist for Tiara, which made its debut in 2009. Human has been open about her plastic surgery experience, revealing on EXO Quiz, "...our job requires us to give joy and entertain a lot of people. It's impossible to do that if you're not pretty." Narisha from Brown Eyed Girls Formed in 2006 under the name Crescendo, the Brown Eyed Girls have been very open about their use of plastic surgery. Narisha, the group's lead vocalist, admitted to Korean talk show radio star that surgery made her a quote, "...much prettier and happier person." And host Kim Goo-ra agreed, saying, "...the Brown Eyed Girls weren't so attractive at the time of their debut. I didn't think they would last very long. It was that kind of attitude that made the girls turn to surgery." Narisha said, "...because we are celebrities, we often get hurt because of our appearance, and as a result, we tend to pay more attention to the way we look." Six Bomb In March 2017, four-member girl group Six Bomb made the boldest statement on plastic surgery in the history of K-pop, releasing a pair of songs called Becoming Prettier Before and Becoming Prettier After. Six Bomb's record company, Pacemaker Entertainment, spent an estimated $93,000 on the stunt. The girls got, quote, "...almost every kind of surgery that could be done on a face, as well as breast enlargements," according to their manager. Lead singer Dane told AFP, "...people will notice it anyway, so we wanted to be open about this reality where many women want to look pretty." The reaction has been a largely negative one, with many fans suggesting that the money would have been better spent on Six Bomb's production quality rather than its members' appearances. Shin Dong from Super Junior Debuting in 2005 with the song Twins, Knockout, Super Junior quickly established itself on the K-pop scene and went on to gain a substantial following abroad, scoring four top 10 hits on the Japan Hot 100 chart. While most members of the group are rumored to have undergone a cosmetic procedure of some kind, Shindong revealed to MIJ that he was pressured to do so by his management, saying, "...one day the president of our agency suggested I should have double eyelid surgery because I have an unpleasant look in my eyes. So I decided to follow his suggestion." Yui from After School after School made its debut in 2009 on NBC's Music Corps, a weekly music show that features live performances from the newest K-pop talent. Rolling Stone called them the Korean version of the Pussycat Dolls, and the group became the first winner of the Billboard Japan Award for K-pop New Artist of the Year. Yui, who is now a graduate member of After School, admitted to dabbling in surgery during an appearance on Sang Sang Plus. She said, "...my eyes are naturally uneven, so I wanted to even them out. That's why I had a minor surgery on my eyes. That's it." These claims were later brought into question when Yui sued a plastic surgeon for using images of her thighs and stomach without her permission on a blog. According to Yui, the doctor was never granted permission to use those images, and the court agreed, hitting him with a fine of about $2,800. Hong Chia-el Solo artist Hong Chia-el has been around since 2007, when he dropped his debut album Five Senses, but he didn't gain mainstream recognition until years later, when he began working in TV. According to South Korea's Hanteo chart, he was the top-selling solo artist for the first half of 2017. Hong has been happy to dish the dirt on his plastic surgery, openly discussing his nose job to Soon-Pi, saying, "...I actually had a nose that curved down. I didn't really have thoughts of plastic surgery, but before debut, my management company said that we should do it, so I agreed." Hara from Kura Created in 2007, Kura was a girl group that was supposed to promote natural looks over plastic surgery. But lead rapper and official face of the group Hara, later revealed that this wasn't truly the case. During an appearance on South Korean talk show Strong Heart, Hara admitted that she had undergone minor procedures, but denied having her entire face done, saying, "...I already had folded eyelids, but to make them more noticeable in pictures, I got them slightly fixed. I didn't get plastic surgery on my nose, I just got a shot. Also, I've had braces for my teeth." <laughs> Thanks for watching. Click the Nikki Swift icon to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Plus, check out all this cool stuff we know you'll love too.